Another big area is with relationships. And when a person's been through a Hodgkin's diagnosis and treatment, often it's their loved ones that go through with them. And that can change the dynamic in a relationship in many, many ways. And so sometimes the relationships will need some help later. And of course, there are things like couples therapy and things that people can use to try to, to not necessarily repair, but continue to grow those relationships and repair if needed. Sexuality can also be a problem for patients after they have been treated for cancer. This can be because of either physical changes or emotional changes. And this is something that often is not easy for an individual to talk with their providers about. But if it goes unattended to, it can be a real problem both for the patient as well as for his or her partner in the long run and their relationship. And so we, we recommend that everybody who's been through a diagnosis and treatment think about this issue. And if things are working fine and you're feeling good, don't worry about it. But if you're having any issues, there can be solutions. Um, some cancer centers have sexual health programs and there are also apps and informational uh, resources available on the web.